Hey guys, welcome to another DIY gymnastics home tutorial. My name is Chris. I've been a rec and competitive level gymnastics coach in Aspen, Colorado for the past 10 years. Today, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do a cartwheel in five easy steps. But before we get into that, I just wanna let you guys know that I am making a full online gymnastics course. This would be for levels one, two, and three boys and girls, all events. So that means bars, floor, balance beam, trampoline, etc. And that can be found at DIY-gymnastics.com. I'll link that below, but I'll go over that more in detail at the end of the video. For now, let's get into those cartwheels. Okay, step one is your takeoff position. And this is something that I call a starfish. I can't tell you guys how many times I've seen someone just sort of bulldoze their way through a cartwheel. And that sets sort of a bad tone for the rest of the trick. Your starting position will heavily determine how well the rest of the trick goes. So obviously do this where you have plenty of room and start by standing in a position that we call a straddle. So this this is where your legs are about a medium width apart, knees are straight. And then additionally, you also want your arms to be straight up in the air near your head. Okay, step two. Before we go for this, we need to decide which way we're gonna cartwheel, right or left. Most people prefer their left foot and subsequently their left hand to be in front. So try that first. As you get into this and it's just not working and that right hand wants to keep going down first, switch your legs so that your right leg is also the front one. Okay, step three is learning how to put your hands down the right way. So you're gonna start by leaning over and putting your leading hand out in front of your leading foot. Those fingers should be pointing towards the side. If your left hand is the leading hand, your finger should point left. If your right hand is the leading hand, your finger should point right. Then your rear hand will come down and go past the front hand about shoulder width and point the same direction. At this point, we're just leaning over and putting our hands on the floor. We haven't kicked up in the air yet, so you should be standing in a pretty awkward position for the moment. Okay, step four is kicking our legs into the air. So from that last position, you're gonna kick your legs up and over yourself, the higher the better, to the other side of your hands, and then stand up smoothly. You should land this facing the same direction that you started in, ideally in that starfish position again. If you can kick your legs directly over your head rather than to the side, that's ideal. I like to pretend I'm in a narrow little hallway doing this. Okay, step five is just putting this all together at full speed. So from a starfish position, hands go down quickly, legs kick up into the air right after that, up and over your head, landing on the other side of your hands, and you stand right up into a starfish position again, facing the same direction. All right, that's a cartwheel, congratulations. Remember, most people don't do this very well at first. You have to get used to it. If you don't regularly do things like this, it's definitely sort of an awkward motion, but once your body has repeated this a bunch of times, it'll do it a lot more fluidly. Good job, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. And again, if you didn't get it right away, no stress. It's just a reps game. So as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, if you guys want to learn all the gymnastics basics in a structured chronological order, the same way it would be taught in a real gym, I am in the process of making or have finished a full online gymnastics course, levels one, two, and three, boys and girls. It's artistic gymnastics. So that means all the events like bars, floor, balance beam, trampoline, all that stuff. And the website I made for that is DIY-gymnastics.com. And for the record, it's for kids and adults. So if that sounds like something fun that you would get a lot of value out of, be sure and check that out. And again, I'll include a link below. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I have a handful of other videos out there with other popular gymnastics tricks. And again, if you want all the tricks in full detail, check out the course. See you in the next video.